All right, I'm back. I didn't film the whole film the thing while I'm working on this thing. But it looks pretty sad again. Back all tore apart. All right, uh, kind of a mess. I was trying to. I need to get a stand for the damn thing, but it's driving me crazy. So it sort of fits in there. You up against the workbench. All right. lights up so I can see what I'm doing here. Here we go. Just to have this thing up. Alright. Oh, sorry. Okay. Now I got this thing apart. I don't... I was just watching the guy on YouTube working on his and I have everything out of here except that really I think you got to get this is the other side now this there's a bolt behind this piece right here and I'm just not going to take this off because I don't think it's necessary but but there's a bolt that bolt holds the transmission I guess but as far as I know, this has to be, I have to take this out and, and this shaft out. But this, you have to take this off in order to get, for the, to split the case. So, but I think you got to take this bolt off. So I'm going to try to do this without having to take the whole thing apart. You know, so let me find my, uh wrenches here so I'm half strung all over the place here I think that's I think that's a 10 millimeter that's a 10 I think this is a 10 a lot of the bolts on this thing are 10 millimeter so I'm going to videotape this so I can reference what I'm doing here. So I need to... I need to get me a little container to put these parts in. Is there a spring on that? That's right. All right, yeah, there's a spring on this right here. See how the spring is? Got a little... So it goes in like this. It must catch... Okay, it must catch on... must catch on this part right here. So, catches like that. Uh, find, trying to find me something to put that stuff in. I've got my stuff all, spilled all over the place here. Let me get this. 
this out of here. I'll put it in here. So that's that part there. Now this thing here, I don't know if I'm going to need to whack that. That's going to be a... It's going to be a little... A little bitchy. Didn't take a whole lot, I guess. Now I know there's some pins in here from what I remember watching these videos. Let's take this screw out. I'll be careful. This is I think that's neutral. I think that's neutral. So it moved on me. Alright. I'm going to put this, these parts in here. Okay. You got four pins in here. This one's standing tall. Looks like two short ones. It looks like they've got a little head on them. I hope you get a pair of these nose pliers. Probably could use a little little magnet. Well, they all well, they all look the same size. So they all look like the same size here. There. I guess you take them out so you don't freaking lose them. Put them right there. I don't. As far as I know, I think this thing just pulls. This whole thing comes out. trick to getting this out or not.
by the way. This goes, that pin right here, I don't know if you can see it, between the two, it goes down between the two spring clips here. So, so it looks like it's going to be a little stubborn. I really have to take this thing off. Probably makes sense though. It basically goes right in here. Well, this this goes down here like so. Which it goes between these two springs. It looks like. Push it back down there. It's definitely, definitely don't want to come out. Let's see if we use a little leverage here.
that's really in there. piece these two go right between this right here so and I, I'm probably guessing that that had something to do with it and I'm a somewhat of a build up here Almost looks like it's bent. Looks like it might be a little bent. Huh, what are we doing? It is a little bent. I might be able to straighten it a little bit. Just don't want to take all this shit apart. I got a bent right here. I think it's right there. That's why it was giving me trouble getting it out. Oh, it looks like. Oh, yeah, it definitely has got a little bend to it. Uh, next step is I probably would have had trouble getting the case apart at that point, I would imagine. I have a tin can over here I've been using. I'm setting things up on it. Definitely gonna have to take the top end off. Well, this will give me access to the bolts here. All these bolts. Okay, that'd be enough for now. I'll just do a video reference. Who looks this? Oh, that was from the... Doing a little video reference. Next part is going to be putting this, uh, taking the head off and I don't know if I'm going to film that or not, but uh, that was, I was doing a video reference so I know what the hell how to put it back together <laughs> but I did find out that that shaft is a little bend to it but uh, I might be able to straighten it out uh, there's ways to do it so 
Alright, that'll be enough for now.